Many people around the world do not have the same leg mobility as their friends and family. There are devices like wheelchairs and a walking bicycle that help them get around. We've actually profiled the inventor of the walking bike, the Alinker, on this show. But for some, the lack of leg movement can restrict them from having any kind of mobile life. Now there are innovators who've worked around the clock to create a new kind of walk. Here's Ali Ward to explain. Rewalk is a robotic exoskeleton that provides powered hip and knee motion to enable some people with spinal cord injury to stand up and to walk. Larry Chasinski is the CEO of Rewalk Robotics, and I traveled to Marlboro, Massachusetts to meet him. What is a Rewalk device? What does it do? The device is simply a enabling technology for someone to be able to walk again through the use of some newer technologies, particularly better software, batteries, sensors, and mechanics. Specifically, the Rewalk is comprised of foot plates in the shoes, motors on the calf and hip, a battery, a waist pack, a backpack which holds the computer and software, sensors, straps, walking crutches for spatial reference to the ground, and a watch that instructs Rewalk when you want to stand, walk, or sit. There's a gentleman named Dr. Amit Gopher, and he was an inventor with a good history in the medical device space and became paralyzed. And Dr. Gopher set about to find a way to look people in the eye by standing and walking with them to regain some of that independence he lost. Since that first prototype was built in a garage, the Rewalk has seen many iterations. Look at these! Dr. Gopher built this device of a number of components that um, didn't necessarily fit together, but fit together in the end. Mm -hmm. And it allowed someone to walk. And you could see these motors, this one would actually be the knee, so they could bend here, and yeah. this would move the hip for each step. This is Darius Crump. And when we met him, he had only been using Rewalk for a couple of months. Jill Butler is a physical therapist and product manager who's teaching Darius how to use the Rewalk. Did you have to do anything to train to prep for this? Yeah, it's, it's a little bit. You got to make sure your bones are ready for the device. Mm -hmm. uh, you want to make sure that uh, you're mentally ready as well. How long had it been since you took a step? Wow. Almost 20 years. 20 years. It's, it's easy to get discouraged from that point, but after that first step, it's just like you're back. The standing part was pretty, it, that was the surreal moment. When you stand up and you hadn't stood up in years, that was something that, um, that was the best part of it. The, the feeling itself is a euphoric feel like you stand up and you can't believe that you're looking at the world in an upright position again. Any idea how many steps you've logged? Yes, I'm at 14,000 now. What? <laughs> Yep, the goal is a million. Do you ever have to just kind of take a moment to soak it in? All the time. When I'm with my wife, we stand up and I kind of look at her in the upright position. I'm looking at the top of her head, try to dance a little bit. She probably didn't realize exactly how tall you were. How were. tall I was. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't realize how short she was. Yeah. 